Oh, it's a beautifully placed shot off the back foot. Nasser Jamshed has played a lovely looking back foot push. Big dive, and the ball will just touches the rope. David Warner is uh, such a good athlete, but couldn't control that shot. It's 19 without a loss after four. Oh, that's dismissed. What a good shot that is from Nasser Jamshed. Oozing confidence is taken on Mitchell Johnson, who's not a medium pacer. We're talking about real pace here. It's that length. Oh, back end of a length. Jamshed, well, he's right into it. Lovely swivel pull. Well and truly in front of it, wicket. This is over wide long on. That's well played, over the top and bouncing away down to uh, the long one boundary. Big by Nasser Jamshed. And he used the infield well played it well over the fielder at mid-on. That's a nice shot. Into the gap. Oh no, well fielded. Well, that looked uh, that looked to me as if it was into the gap and it was uh, way to the boundary. But uh, very good fielding again. Oh, that's a beautiful cut of drive. That's one whistling away to the boundary before. It's the 50 partnership, but uh, John Shed here is playing a gem of an innings. A start clearly struggling because of the dew, holding the ball across the seam. Still, Jim Shed gets the whip and he plays a beautiful shot, watches it right till the end. Four more. Yes, you won't see many better cover drives than that one. Sensible call there from the non-striker. It's 52 for none. That's gone. Beautifully played away. That's six. Wow. He showing some serious talent against a quality side. We're talking about dealing with Australia. Nasser Jamshed has put one over square leg for a massive six. Into the 40s now. He looked cramped, didn't he, to play it, and yet he still hit it well enough to get over the boundary. He looked just a little bit cramped. With quick hands. See, he hasn't had time to really extend the arms. But quick hands and good timing. And that's his 50. Wonderful innings from Nasser Jamshed. 6.15 in ODI's first versus Australia will... He should be very proud of his achievement against a quality side when his team needed an opener to fire well he's provided pakistan with a wonderful platform here the fans like it but his job has just started he needs to uh, kick on and carry on till most part of the innings take you further for the next half an hour with Sikandar Bak. that's his 50 Definitely he knows that he needs to continue and go further. His job is not done yet. That's his wagon wheel. A couple of good boundaries uh, on the offside and then two one bounce hits on the onside. He's looking confident. And well, there's another one. And it's four more with the slide as well. Uh, flowing nicely from the blade of Jamshed. 
That was a very good shot, nicely placed, and Max will try it. His level best, I think, uh, the two actually slided him out, and the ball just went to the boundary. That was a good try, very good try, but desperate attempt, the ball just reaches the boundary. Probably on a normal day, if there wasn't any dew, the ball would have stopped. Just slipped through those fingertips. Under fives, and here goes some more. Big pumping, and the crowd are loving it here. Jamshed is cutting loose. Top shot. What a shot by Nasser Jamshed. He's really looking good. The only man I think out there in the field is looking comfortable. That was a slow one again. And there goes Bang, Nasser Jamshed. What a beautiful shot. And the distance between the two teams at the same stage is just increasing. 106 for one Pakistan Australia was 64 for one. And Nasser Jamshed, this man is the difference between the two sides at this stage. We got the dance moves out here too in the UAE. I was going to say on a Friday night, but it's turned into a hot Saturday morning. It is all go. The sliding in the... Another slow one. And it's turning out, actually, Sekinder to be a good toss to lose. Because Pakistan, they wanted a bat as well. And there's that last one. Listen to that great cracking stroke on the onside. Brilliant. Yeah, you're right, Danny. Australia at the moment is battling two opponents. One is Pakistan, is one is... <laughs> What's wrong with it? What, what do you call that move? <laughs> That's a little bit of moving and grooving on the dance floor. <laughs> Beautiful. Just stands and delivers and pumps another boundary. That's number eight for Jamshed to go with his two maximums. Really amazing, amazing knock and what a shot. He's completely in control of every shot that he's playing. And he's getting those gaps. Once again, a slower ball. Christian is just not getting it right. No, he's just uh, created a little bit sometimes uh, just length and width. Nasser Jamshed and Azrali. Look at the contribution. Azrali doing well rotating the strike and giving more to Nasser Jamshed. Lovely timing. What an elegant stroke out towards the fence and doesn't get there. So uh, they're going to go upstairs and check that, I would say, but uh, it looks pretty good. 121 for one after 19, and it'll stay that way. Good save. Great effort. Uh, look at uh, Jamshid. He's just starting to feel it. He's gone into the 70s. Well, that's beautifully played. One bounce for four. Well, I mean, how do you, uh, how do you describe this? This was a magnificent. Yes, not just getting to 83. Well, he's gone to 87 in one hit. But getting to 100 and perhaps even 130 and seeing to it that the match is won by the batsman. That's uh, absolutely spot on, especially in the last sentence. Seeing to it. He's now just uh, held up a little bit here in the legs. Starting to go. As you say, the uh, petrol's running out of the tank. Great contribution by uh, these two. Lion's share of it, of course, to the man on the left of screen. Nazarali just uh, 26, but uh, Jamshed's been in such great touch tonight. And catch, and he's gone, would you believe it? Just as we were praising his effort, his shoulder went away. Probably because of the cramps that he was suffering from. But Australia have tasted a vital scalp and a 
and got rid of Nasser Jamshed as he was just looking good for a hundred. Didn't time it and he was in real pain and bother. Well, Robin Jack 